Hey guys, Triple C here. Today we're gonna look at some of the benchmark softwares on the Android 2.1, and we're going to benchmark the Remus W9 tablet. So I already downloaded a bunch of benchmark software, and we're just gonna go and take a look and see how well the W9 performs. All right. So first off, the impact for Android. Here we go. It's gonna take a little bit. Four point oh nine makeup floats. Next up, pi calculation. It's called benchmark pi. Mm. Eighty-six thirty-eight milliseconds. Next up, the application code CPU benchmark. Hmm. You don't have a stress test function. I don't know what that result is. The clock speed is not even correct. Oh well. Next up, a low program code input benchmark. Well, this device doesn't have multi-touch. So we're gonna go with the touch. Drive the screen at median speed. Okay. So 23 hertz. Alright. What's the cellometer? Move your phone, average of blah blah blah. Do not know what that means, but 30 hertz. Okay, next up, J benchmark. What J benchmark is, is to uh, benchmark your hard, uh, internal storage versus the SD card. So, uh, let's give it a try. Everything at the default. System then allowed the program to access the cache. Program proceed to test procedure without cleaning caches. We can flush the cache if it runs on manufactured test mode. Yeah, I don't know how to do that. Maybe that's the routing they're talking about.
almost almost done. <laughs> it's not responding. Let's wait for a bit. Okay. So what do we got here? Test result, right performance, and re performance. Right there. 0 0.7 megabyte per second and 1 megabyte per second. I don't know if that's good or bad. Oh well. So that's that. This is a mem bench, memory bench. It didn't even give me a chance to press anything, it just starts by itself. So there you go. Is to testing its memory, which the W9 equipped it with a 256 megabyte of DDR2 memory. So, uh, uh, I guess that's it. Those are the results. Okay. So this is the 2D benchmark. I already showed that in the first video, but do it again. And try it again. Ugh. Fifty-seven frames per second.